he's probably going to aim at the fork, considering the fork is in front of the side idea. pocket. Perfect shot, and he hit the four just like he said. Not accidental, because that ball assured him of getting position if yeah. he hit it. Talk with him a little earlier, I said, Efren, you know, here, this is going to be the final match of the tournament. Another one. Oh my. Shoot the three in this pocket. Meanwhile, so they don't get lucky. <laughs> Did you do this rap yourself? Huh? Is that your rap? Yeah. Okay. What? What? I guess that means to everybody it's not the cue, is it? No, that's only this rap. Oh. <laughs> what is up, bull fans? Today is a really mind-blowing match. This is the finals of the Derby City Classic 2005. And of course, the legendary and the defending champion, the pool hero and the pride of the Philippines, Efren Mbata Reyes, once again made his way to the finals and will be matching up against an American professional hustler, James Barracks. Bro, what are you talking about, man? There we go. This is the finals of the nine ball division. Ball. No, he missed the nine ball. The side ball went. So. This finals match is scheduled for a race to seven. The rule is winners break format. A friend won the leg and breaks the first track of the game. He makes the one ball in the side and will have a long shot on the two. Yeah, he's better than that. He's holding up real well under the, the situation. Look at this control. That was great control. At this time, Efren Reyes is the defending champion of this tournament. Efren has been known not to give people any he was the all-around champion of the Derby City Classic 2004. He won the 9-ball and the 1-pocket series events. The year 2004 is one of the best years of his career. And now, another shot for the Derby City Classic title, 2005. That's exactly the way it this is gig <laughs> And Efren Reyes takes the first track okay, of the match. We go now to rock number two, Efren on the break. As you have noticed, the magician successfully puts the one ball into the side pocket. He has already played a lot in this table, so he knows how to break well here. If he continues to break like this, James Barracks may spend more time on his comfortable chair. The magician goes to work and cleans the table effortlessly. A clean break and run out from the Filipino legend. Now Efren Reyes leads two rocks to zero against James Barracks. Well, that's a 
He said 85, so I've just... No, he won the tournament in 84. This is Rock 3, Efren on the break. And once again, he made the one on the side and makes another in the corner pocket. Cesar Morales, he went for $100 in the Calcutta. And you know the whole truth of the matter? At the time, he could have set up for the Okay, that was a key shot in the round. Yeah, boy. Unfortunately, Efren made a mistake because he overran position for the three ball next. He hooked himself behind the four ball, so he may have to play a kick safe here. Well, he added something new in the game when we had this uh, uh, any foul ball. He added, he added, he added the kick safe. Okay, Jimmy Barrett's probably best step to the table. He only can see himself behind the, uh, the pink four ball. He doesn't have a shot on the three. I don't know if he even hit the part of the ball from my vantage point. I think he's going to have to hit this with some speed. Three balls in no man's land, and he's kicked it and hit it solid. Made the nine. He made the nine, I swear he did. Oh, oh. No. Finally, James Barracks comes to the table, but only finding himself without a direct shot on the three ball. He was forced to kick, hits the three ball full, but left a friend with an open table. Before the match has started tonight, he had already won the all-around 20,000 and that may have loosened his stroke up but stuck out his tongue. That's uh, what he does when he does something wrong. And at this point, the American player has not yet potted a single ball. Here we are. He's looking to win game number three. Right. Again. Well, he's got to be feeling unbeatable right now. The rolling for right? He just kicked the ball to the the guy. Yeah, boy. Now Efren Reyes leads the game three rocks to nothing. Sure. We move now to rock number four, the magician on the break. He did not put the one ball this time, but makes the wing ball into the corner pocket. He will have a shot on the one ball, but position on the two is difficult. Efren somehow managed to get the cue ball near the two ball and executes a well played defensive shot. No! James Barracks went for a one reel kick on the two ball. Unfortunately, though, he did not get lucky. Efren Reyes was rewarded with ball in hand because of his great effort on a defensive play. The magician is about 51 years of age at this time. What about alternate break in the final? Now the Filipino player still leading this match 4 to nothing. This was a really difficult time for the American player because at this point he did not really get a good opportunity to somehow get into the match. This I think is one of the consequences of a winner's break format. <laughs> This is Rock 5, Efren once again with a really nice break. He made a wing ball and with a shot on the one. Perfect shot and he hit the four just like he said. 
not accidental because that ball assured him of getting position. <laughs> what a shot from Efren using the four ball to get position on the two ball next. And the magician again with an open table. In this year 2005, Efren won six international titles, including the IPT King of the Hill against Mike Siegel. Efren Reyes easily runs out rack number five. He's just two rocks away from victory. And ball right in. We go now to rock six. Something really interesting happened here. Efren Reyes does not have a shot on the one ball. And it's really interesting how he played a push here. I would push, put him on top of the two. Pretty good hit. Oh, he wants to leave him straight in on the ball, and maybe he's feeling sorry. He wants the guy to, to shoot something in. What? A friend pushed for a straight in shot on the one ball. He also breaks the five off the three ball. What do you think about that move from the magician? Okay, he made a ball. Everybody should clap. Well, that was solid. Yeah, that was impressive as well. Because he's a six. And finally, James Barracks potted his first ball of the match. Well, the three to the four, the, well, under the layout here, is the only one you could say could be a problem. Things could still go well for James Barracks. Or not even better. Well, it is. Position-wise, game isn't anything tricky at all. If he shoots well and could break well, the game could still be unpredictable. If you think Efren gave him this rack, like this video. And now the first nine ball for James Barracks. At last, the American player landed on the scoreboard. A glimpse of hope for the aspiring champion. We have reached rock number seven. Barracks on the break. He broke well, but did not land with good position on the one ball. Instead, James Barracks went for a defensive shot. Efren can see the one ball, so a good counter save is available. What a shot from the magician. A really good cue ball control. Barracks went two rails, but left a friend with an open shot. You practice by your shed. Efren still has a problem on the two ball here. The seven is going towards the three. He didn't draw it out to the middle. Shoot the three of this time. Now he's going to have to elevate slightly over the eight because. Well, I don't know. I have to play good. <laughs> Efren Reyes never fails to entertain the pool fans.
passing exhibits, creative shooting, and a humble heart. That is why people flock together just to watch this man play. Even if this is the finals match, it seems that it does not bother him at all. Now Efren Batareas on the hill, 6 to 1. There's the one in the corner. Got a little bit of a kiss there. Pocket the one in the corner. And the six in. Uh, this is Rock 8. A friend on the break. He's going to go away from the red three, so there's no reason for him to play position here. He'll play some sort of a safety. Repositioning the cue ball down table, perhaps in back of the orange five, like so. Barracks one. What a really well played a defensive shot on the two ball, completely hiding it behind two object balls. It no, it's short. It's short, and Efren has. It's okay. Barracks did well on the kick, but unfortunately, again left Efren with an open shot. And this could only mean one thing for the American player. Efren landed funny here, but all is well for the Filipino magician. And it was discovered later in this match that Efren was playing with an improvised grip on his cue stick. And once again, Efren Reyes won the Derby City Classic 2005 and became a back to back champion, master of the table. He performed really well and was not in any struggle in whatsoever. Uh, you won the all-around again. Uh, what does that mean to you and to people in the Philippines? Oh, I think uh, they're happy, you know. A uh, uh, lot of uh, poor people in the Philippines too, they've been happy, you know. I think they were waiting for me now. Did you do this rap yourself? <laughs> huh? Is yeah. that your rap? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I really believe a friend did this rap himself and secured it with an electrical tape. What do you think, Bull fans? I guess that means to everybody it's not the cue, is it? No, that's only this rap. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. We appreciate your like and this video very much. Your unending support is what keeps us going. See you in the next match. God bless.